okay. You won that one, Jesse. Let's maybe get inside the mansion before we pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? That front door is definitely a no-go. <laughs> Stick with me, guys. The heck? What? What'd you see? You just gasped. L like you'd seen something. No, no. Who he was? Some creepy guy in the window. He had a white pumpkin for a head. White pumpkin? No such thing as white pumpkin. Let's save the agricultural discussions for inside, okay? <sighs> Great! There's no door back here. How are we supposed to get in? There. We should be able to build up and break in through there. Trees. We can cut those down. Good plan. Now my inventory is full of wood blocks. Hey, you never know when those will come in handy. Looks like some kind of kitchen in there. Then break the window and get us into the blasted place. Hope the host doesn't mind us breaking their window. I'm sure he'll find it in his heart to forgive us. Wow, some kitchen. Dog. You know I don't care if you took it. Just give it back. And I'm telling you for the last time, Sparkles, I didn't take the stupid thing. I think we could avoid a lot of unpleasantness. Uh. If... What the? Hi. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very, very funny. Show up super late, make us all sit and wonder what the heck is going on. And this is your house, right? Because if it is, we've all been waiting for like hours. It's rude. We're not the host of whatever this is. Sorry, we're just... Here to hide from the sea of zombies. Yeah, it's pretty bad out there. In case you hadn't noticed. No way. Be polite. No, I'm I'm afraid we're not the ones behind this either. This is Tork Dog. Sup. And I'm Captain Sparkles. Though, maybe you know that already. Captain Sparkles? I've got like nine million fans. Captain Sparkles? Are you saying that with a Z? It really is awesome to meet you. I'm Jesse, and that's Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. Charmed. <clears throat> Jesse? That's a girl's name. What are you guys, anyway? Some sort of <clears throat> loser patrol? Talk dog. Oh, come on. That was hilarious. Actually, we're the Order of the Stone. Legendary heroes. Kind of a big deal. <laughs> Legendary heroes? <laughs> I ain't never heard of you. Talk dog. Cool it! That sea of zombies has us all trapped, so we just need to try our best to get along. Worst day ever! Just try and look on the bright side. Maybe we can all work together to get through those zombies, power in numbers and all that? That's what we're trying to figure out. Just can't get everyone to work together. I tell you what, the minute all them weird zombies are gone, <sighs> Torque Dog is out of here! Okay, so the sea of zombies isn't normal. It's good to hear. Two moons is normal, though, right? Um, the moons? Uh, yeah. Why don't you know about this stuff? Are you from, like, out of town or something? Ah! Did you hear that? Something touched my foot! Who touched my foot? I think it's... Everyone die for cover! Hey, Jesse. Jesse, come here. You've got a, a girl's name. Uh. Uh. Torque dog? Torque dog? So I'm guessing calling dibs on his inventory would be. That poor guy, that's so awful. 
Yeah, he uh, seemed like a little bit of a jerk, but that's still a nasty way to go. All those arrows, this inventory, everywhere. How did that, who, one minute he's alive, the next, gone, poof. Sparkles, I know you're freaking out right now, but you've got to pull yourself together. Okay, okay, you're right. Woo. You're right. Everyone stand back. Let me see what I can figure out. This is, why is this happening? Gunpowder, redstone dust, leather pants. Pretty much what you'd expect, I guess. <gasps> Who would do this? There's the trap door that sucked up Torque Dog's stuff. Looks like it's a match set with that arrow dispenser up there. But you saw his stuff. He didn't really have anything worth stealing. Perhaps it was simply to dispose of the evidence. This whole thing is getting creepier by the minute. Guys, found something strange about this arrow. Yeah, Ivor, you know potions and enchantments and weird stuff like that. What do you make of it? Smells like... Yes. Potion of poison? Oh, is it a tipped arrow? Oh, I've heard of those. They're... they're still pretty new. Oh, nasty stuff. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. You say you know about these tipped arrows? Anything else you know that you're not telling us? Well, you're, you're not implying what I think you're implying, are you? Because I had nothing to do with this. Nothing! could have sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. But my nerves are too shot to remember who right now. Well, let me know if it comes back to you. Hello? Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh, I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. Okay? Hang on a minute. It's you. I recognize you. Excuse me? Uh, yes. What? Recognize us? How? I'll show you. Follow me. Um, okay. Lizzie, hi. Did you see all these new... Oh, you've got them with you. <gasps> Well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof, you guys. Whoa, that's unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. They're absolutely exquisite. Perfect. Well, not perfect. Absolutely perfect. Must have been when we showed up. Somebody's up to something. I don't know what yet, but I'm gonna figure it out. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. Come on, everyone. Oh, let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Ooh, I hope there's cake. Guess not. Come on, let's do this. Come on, Winslow. Here, let me introduce you all properly. You guys already met Cassie Rose and LD Shadow Lady. Uh, but my friends call me Lizzie. This is Stacy Plays, Stampy Cat, and that's Dan, the Diamond Minecart. W when did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other here. They're the Order of the Stone. Jesse, Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. Apparently, they're famous heroes where they come from. You said there was news? Is it good? Good news? Uh, yeah. It's, um, bad news, I'm afraid. Torque Dog is dead. Good heavens! Oh, no. Wait. What? But Torque Dog was so tough. There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? 
These are what got him. Tipped arrows? Does this mean someone set a trap for Torque Dog? That's nasty. I can't believe Talk Dog's gone. Just like that. So, what happened to his stuff? Whoa! How can you say that? What? It's a valid question. Whoa. Come on, everyone. Come on. Don't get greedy. Just... I want to know what happened. For curiosity's sake. His stuff just disappeared. Went down this weird hole in the floor. Are we just supposed to take your word for that? Guys, I saw it too. Jesse was poking around in Torque Dog's stuff right before it got sucked into a hopper. So I'm looking at this situation, I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah, why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. Knowing Torque Dog, I think this might just be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Uh, what? No! I don't know what you're talking about. What, like you think he deserved it? Well, that sounds pretty harsh, but, uh, I don't know, maybe? Well, someone brought us here for a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh, Dan's right! Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us! Hey, come on, everyone. If there's one thing I believe in, it's teamwork. If we all stick together and get through this as a team, we'll be fine. Ha, <laughs> inspiring. There you go, guys. Teamwork makes the dream work. Wow. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. Lizzie, psst, Lizzie. The more I think about it, the more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. One of them's got to know the truth about what's going on here. Sounds like we've got a mystery to solve, people. Luckily, Detective Jesse is on the case. Let's get investigating, then. Hey there, Dan. Lizzie? Oh, uh, hello? Hi there. If you don't mind, I actually had some questions about this torque dog situation. Yeah? Go ahead. Lizzie, seems like you're not much of a Torque Dog fan. What's the deal? Oh, come on. You met him, right? Nobody liked that guy. I'm just the only one who will actually admit it. He, um... Yeah, he definitely wasn't the nicest person. It seemed like people were really interested in seeing Torque Dog's inventory. Any idea why? An adventurer like him? He could have had all kinds of cool stuff. Uh-huh. Torque Dog was clearly targeted with this trap. Why him? Well, he was bragging about having some kind of rare item. Wouldn't show it to anyone, of course. Typical Torque Dog. So this rare item that Torque Dog claimed to have? What can you tell me about it? We don't know exactly. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Okay, that's it for now. Thanks. What'd you find out? It's all tangled up, but it sounds like Torque Dog claimed to have some sort of rare item. I didn't see anything like that in his inventory, though. Yeah, something's not quite adding up here. Hey, Sparkles, and Cassie Rose, yeah? Yep, hi, that's me. Hey there, Jesse. Oh, Winslow says hi, too. <laughs> you mind if I ask you guys some questions? Nope. What are the questions? There was drama between Lizzie and Torque Dog, right? Got any insight? Sorry, I'm not getting wrapped up in that. Especially now that Torque Dog is, you know... But it's weird, right? Definitely seems like there's some beef. Uh, not that I um, want to get into rumors or anything like that. Got any guesses why someone would kill Torque Dog? Uh, gosh, gosh, um, he was a little prickly around the edges, you know? You'd have to ask other people about that. I, I didn't really know him. Mm-hmm. I don't want to say anything mean about a guy that's not here to defend himself, but, well, you met him, right? Prickly is kind of an understatement. 
Cassie, you seem pretty upset about people wanting to poke around Torque Dog's inventory. Oh, was I? Yeah, yeah, you were. Why was that? Well, it was just so... It's insensitive, right? I mean, it, it had just happened, and she was all curious about what was in his pockets. Just made me mad, I guess. Sparkles, Cassie, Winslow, thanks for the time. No problem. Uh, yeah, anytime. Get anything out of them? Found out this group has a whole lot of secrets they're keeping from each other. That's definitely something. Hey, guys. Hey, Jesse. How's it going? Yeah, find anything out yet why Torque Dog was... you know... There are stories flying around about some rare item that Torque Dog claimed to have. People seem pretty hesitant to talk about it, though. Mysterious. I wonder what it is. Hey guys, Stampy and Stacy, right? Oh, um, uh, hello! Hey, Jesse. What's up? I know things are a little nuts right now, but I've got some questions. Oh, really? Uh, but what? Stacy, you seem pretty curious about what was in Torque Dog's inventory. What's up with that? Well, Torque Dog was a pretty notorious thief. I was just curious what he had. That's it. Mm-hmm. Seems like Lizzie and Torque Dog really didn't like each other. Know anything else about that? Oh, that! Real shame, real shame. He broke into her house and stole a bunch of stuff from her. She was super upset about it. You don't say. Anyone you can think of that would want something bad to happen to Torque Dog? Um, well, I never had that big of a problem with him personally, but I know other people did. Quite a few, actually. I don't know if you noticed, but he was a bit of a griefer. Yeah, and a thief. Thief, huh? Interesting. Thanks, you two. This has been enlightening. No problem. Yeah, no problem. So did you find anything out from Stacy or Sturdy Cat? Stampy Cat? Right, right. So did you find anything out? Apparently, Torque Dog was a well-known thief. A thief, huh? Well, that might have something to do with it, don't you think? Agreed. So, Torque Dog was a thief, and he supposedly had something rare, but I feel like there's still a piece missing. No one will tell me what this rare item is. I, uh, I think I can shed some light on that situation, actually. Well, now my curiosity has peaked. Oh, thank goodness someone's being direct with me. Thanks, Sparkles. There's a temple, way out in the middle of nowhere. No one knows who built it, but it's been there forever. People have been trying to track down the temple's location for ages because they want this treasure. It's supposedly deep in its basement. Now, it looks just like an ordinary flint and steel, but it's actually super rare. It's got this enchantment on it. It can open portals to other worlds? Exactly. Wait, what? You know about the enchanted flint and steel? How did you know that? I actually have one of my own. Really? Yeah, I do. Just use it a little no, while ago to put get... Put that away. You, you can't just pull that out here. Okay. Uh, you know, I had a theory about why you were here, and I, I think this might just prove it. Everyone? Everyone? We've all been freaking out, wondering why we were all brought here. Why uh, Torque Dog died? Uh, and Jesse has just uncovered a very important clue. What? Really? Whoever killed Torque Dog, whoever invited us, they're after the enchanted flint and steel. Ah! Sparkles? Panic, 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 what panic, 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 Sparkles! Greetings, adventurers. I am the White Pumpkin. One of you has the treasure I desire. I will not rest until it is mine, even if I have to resort to murder.
thing as white oh, pumpkins. The white pumpkins hanging all over the place. Oh, oh, oh. I don't like it. I really don't. I actually saw him in the window when we first got here. You mean he's been in here the whole time? I'm so getting out of here. for a nice dinner party. And if we're stuck in here, we're all doomed. I thought I heard Sparkle say something about a flint and steel. Oh, please don't bring that up again. Well, obviously Talk Dog didn't steal it. Okay, but who then? Uh, Jesse? Well, I guess I'm next then. Nope, not happening. Don't worry, Ivor. I'll protect you. I appreciate that, Jesse. I just hope that this white pumpkin isn't beyond both of our abilities. Well, I'm sure there's a perfectly logical explanation for how the white pumpkin is doing all this. I mean, the whole place has got to be rigged with traps, right? Torque Dog, trap. Sparkles, trap. Yeah, we need to find out what makes these traps tick. All right, I'm gonna investigate that dining room. Cool. I'll keep those guys in the hall for now so I can keep an eye on everyone. An excellent idea. Don't want them messing up the crime scene. I'm sticking with you, Jesse. Doesn't seem safe to wander off alone. Okay, people, clear out. This is a crime scene. <laughs> <laughs> 